let's get cooking. Yeah, this could be a problem. Good morning, friends. I woke up like this. I just woke up and I am starting on my morning routine, getting some laundry in and uh, getting the kids ready for summer school. I hope you guys have a great morning. Ooh, don't mind me with this lighting and no makeup, it's scary. Okay, we are in Walmart and we're just picking up some things. So these guys got new bathing suits and flip flops for the summer, <sighs> crazy. But I wanna show you something that irks me every time I come to Walmart, like every time. I even asked a store manager why and she had no answer for me. Are you ready? It's so disturbing. Really? Bread near chemicals? Really? It, it has bothered me for years. I don't know why they do it, and they don't have an answer either. I just don't get it. Look what Shaylee spotted right by the register. More of the patriotic candy. Walmart is carrying them. But I didn't see these at uh, Shopco. Yeah, the Hershey's miniatures. How we have the pickles? So there you go, guys. You can get all your patriotic Hershey Kisses miniatures Mom, and Reese's Mom, peanut butter cups. Mom, we had yeah, I think I might need to do some dishes. Don't you think? <laughs> a lot of you asked me about this thing, and I got it as a gift for my uncle, and he doesn't know where he got it from. So I did find the link for something similar and I'll post it below. I don't know if you guys know, but I created a new blogging, uh, vlogging schedule. Okay, and so I post Sunday, a week in the life, Monday, motivational Monday, nothing on Tuesday, Wednesday is um, either food or random, nothing on Thursday, Friday, date my husband Friday, or something, tips, whatever, no Saturday. So now it's Sunday, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So my family did not tell me that they spilled something in the oven. Yeah, this could be a problem. So Shaylee and I are going to bring dinner over to a family in the neighborhood, some friends of ours, and I made them Lazy Man lasagna. This is ours, this is going in the oven. Theirs is in an aluminum pan, so they don't have to do any cleaning. Made them some garlic bread and some salad, and I have a bag of croutons to give to them. And yeah, so this is their dinner, and our dinner is well tonight. Yo, how you doing? <laughs> I am doing okay. Um, I am happy. I, I'm in a good mood, but my heart is literally pumping out of my chest. I'm dealing with some major anxiety today, and... Um, and I haven't felt this way in a long time. Um, I didn't take my Gamma or Sam E last night. Those are the supplements that I take at night to help with my anxiety. I didn't take them because I was working on last night's vlog. And then I, I go through this wave, you guys. It happens maybe once a month, but more than likely once every two months, where all of a sudden my body well, it's tired at night, but all of a sudden it does this like switch and I am awake and my brain won't shut off and I'm thinking and I'm like literally like creating things and like, oh, this is a good idea. And then I, I just can't turn off my brain. Well, that was last night. And, um, and then I started looking at a project that I will be starting on the end of this month and you guys will know about it. It's pretty dang cool and exciting. Um, and I started getting really worried about it and doubting myself and um, just second guessing myself. And I had to force myself to go to bed last night. I went to bed at four in the morning. <sighs> That's when my vlog goes live. Four in the morning, Mountain Standard Time. So I was answering the first few comments. I hadn't even gone to bed yet. So I forced myself to go to bed and I knew this morning that I would have anxiety, but I forgot to take my meds before I went to bed. So today I'm just, I am, I'm struggling, but I'm happy. <laughs> I'm happy and um, I'm able to still work through it, which is amazing. I'm not paralyzed. I was able to get ready 
and get things done. The only thing, uh, we did miss one appointment today. Um, because of it, I just was like, it, it, it just can't happen today. So, but that that's it. That was the only hiccup. But, but even though I'm like talking to you right now and I'm happy, my heart is racing. My chest hurts. So, um, I took some Cavavance or Cavanese. I never know how to pronounce it. Uh, and I'm saving my supplements for the night because it does help promote sleep. So I'm I'm just gonna work through it and just keep on trucking and then it'll calm down. But I have to get to bed like on time or early tonight. I I, I if I can't turn my brain off, oh well. I have got to go to bed. Um, it's crazy. Like my best ideas come late at night. It's the strangest thing. Um, <laughs> Anywho, it's like, okay, Heavenly Father, I'm loving the inspiration, but can I get this at like, you know, during the day? <laughs> so it's a very rare thing where I could pull an all-nighter and that was pretty much last night. I probably got two hours of sleep. So maybe, I don't even know if I hit REM. <laughs> Anywho, do you guys get like that? Leave below, do you ever, oh my gosh, does this ever happen to you? So we were heading over to my friend's house and she just turned 40 and had a birthday a little bit ago and I couldn't make it to her party so I'm going to bring her her gift. This is from Bath and Body Works. They had this cute set together of the, I know I'm pronouncing it wrong, Oahu Coconut Sunset. It smells so good. We have this spray and it's, oh. We have the spray and it smells so good. Shaylee loves wearing it. So I am going to give this to her as a late birthday gift. How was school? Good. And we go to the pool. Let's go swimming! Okay, the kids are taking a break and eating their lunch. Look at that. Okay, you're ready for your other half of your sandwich? There you go. I got this cute tote bag from Walmart and you can, you can move these wire pieces up and then it flattens. So I got this for like eight bucks I think at Walmart or 14, I can't remember. But I got it at the beginning of the spring season to have. So this is holding all our sunscreen and towels and shirts and cameras. And then this bag I got from Walmart and it's refrigerated too. Um, and then this, is, this has all the food in it. So yeah, I put all the pool toys in this tote. It's so cute. Walmart, you guys. You guys are enjoying that. Is it delicious? Yeah. <laughs> I used to do that when I was little too. Did you guys have a good day today? It was a lot of fun, huh? Yeah, we gotta go because mommy's gotta get ready for a church activity. Yep, you can come with me. It is Friday afternoon and I am making Lappy Joes. So, and but Shaylee doesn't want to wait for the Sloppy Joes, so she's having a sandwich. They had a late start to the day. They slept in because they were exhausted from the pool yesterday. They got a lot of sun, and um, they slept a long time. I didn't even wake them. I was like, they didn't have summer school today, so it was like today's Friday, and so um, yeah. So I let them sleep in and. Now we're gonna have a late lunch, so, and that's okay, because then they can have dinner and go to bed at a good time. Because we gotta wake up early to go to Park City for tomorrow to watch Jonah in his lacrosse tournament, so, yeah. So, I am gonna hurry and make her her ham sandwich, and then we're gonna get going on the Sloppy Joes, and it is the Pioneer Woman recipe, love it. Okay, you've guys seen my recipe cabinet in my binders. I do have a video on this, so go check it out. So my sloppy dough recipe is under beef and seafood. 
so I'm, I need that. And would you look at that? It's on the first page. So, yep, this is from Ree Drummond. She's the pioneer woman, and this is her Sloppy Joe recipe, and it is amazing. Best homemade Sloppy Joe recipe I've ever had. So I'm browning up my ground beef, and I'm about to chop up my one green bell pepper and my large onion. So I drained the fat, and I added my chopped onion and pepper, now we're gonna add um, some water and ketchup and garlic. Okay, I added a cup and a half of ketchup, five cloves of minced garlic, and one cup of water. I'm gonna stir this all together and then we're gonna add some spices to this. Okay, I added a few, um, few splashes of hot sauce, two teaspoons chili powder, about a teaspoon of ground mustard, half a teaspoon of red pepper flakes, two tablespoons of brown sugar, and so we're just going to mix this. And then we're gonna get this to a boil and then simmer. And then I taste it and see what I wanna add. Sometimes I add a little more hot sauce or chili powder. But I'm gonna get this heated through. Oh, there's also salt, pepper, and Worcestershire sauce. Can't forget the Worcestershire sauce. It's so good. I'm going to let this simmer on low heat for about 20 minutes. And uh, yeah, go from there. And the Worcestershire sauce just add to taste. Okay, I'm going to let this, I'm going to cover this and let this simmer for 20 minutes. And there you go, there is the Sloppy Joes. They are so good. They're our favorite recipe, yum. It is bedtime, but before bedtime, we're doing stories. stories. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, friends. Ooh, I know I look scary. It is Saturday morning, and I'm making the men some breakfast. Jonah has the last day of this lacrosse tournament up in Park City. They won both their games yesterday. We won over all, of, all our games. All of their games. Yesterday and Thursday. So I'm making him a high protein breakfast so we can kick some more butt today. Boston is at a scout camp, a scout ninja camp this morning. So um, I'll be missing his first game, but we're gonna drive up to see his second game. He might have a third, depending on what they're doing, huh? There you go. Is any of the bacon ready? Yes, bacon is ready. Where are the plastic forks? Where's the plastic forks? All the plastic forks that you stuck in my purse? Yeah. I need those. Right there. Yeah, did you guys see that video where he put all those plastic forks in my purse? Go check it out if you haven't seen it. Silly Nilly. I love this bacon and sausage from Bacon Fresh, you guys. We have been loving it. It's so good. It's worth it. If you want to go check it out, links below. So good. We're loving the pork link sausage. Oh, the house smells so good. All these yummy breakfast smells. Mm -mm -mm. Bacon, bacon. Mm. It's not Saturday morning without bacon or sausage or pancakes or eggs. Oh, so good.
Well guys, thanks for joining me today. I am gonna go sit down and enjoy some hot buttered homemade bread. Thanks for joining us this week. I hope you guys are doing awesome. Hope you're having a great weekend and we'll see you tomorrow. There is a fun, fun video for you. One that you guys have been requesting for a long time. So join me tomorrow. We'll see you later. Bye. Turtles.